Hi guys, so I'm starting a new 1.16 Let's Play as I've had a few comments for me to do one of these. So I've called it 1.16 Let's Play. It's survival, it's normal, so it's completely standard. It's infinite, so it's an infinite world with like no weird stuff. And I'm going to give it the seed one, two, three, three, as I know this is an amazing seed. So I've put show coordinates on because it's useful and that's it so let's see what it's like okay loading screen generating worlds so um it's in, all in the new edition so we can get to the nether and things and yes here it is the good old mesa and yes um so if you think or will enjoy this then don't forget to absolutely smash that like button just do it without breaking your screens because i'm not paying for damages okay just got that in mind there good okay so this is an amazing seed we've got the mesa over there with some abandoned mine shafts spawners to make xp farms and that kind of stuff and then over here we've got the village and um, because i'm in survival um I i'm gonna steal i'm a thief so um, mate, your house is mine now. Thanks. Yes. Here, my new home. What's in the chest? Oh, some iron. Some trees. And one piece of gold. Okay, so our goal is to get all the new nether-related achievements and all, all of the standard ones as well. So we've got to do all of this new stuff. So, mate, I need an iron door. Can you make me one? Huh? Uh, no, he, he's useless. Bye. Okay, so I'm going to chop down some trees to get myself some wood because I have a feeling it's going to be very necessary. So, um, as I do this, you guys, in the comments below, write any suggestions for my base design because I'm not going to, like, make a proper base this episode. So if you guys want to have a say in what base I'm going to make, then leave your suggestion in the comments below and I will try to follow them. <sighs> wow, this is a big tree. Okay, I'm not going to take that much. Hello, Snorter. Right. So, I know that there is a diamond in that ravine because I've played this world before. I'm just going to see any other villagers willing to trade with me because I want to trade with them. Ah, there's a farmer. So, he might sell some emeralds for crops and the crops are here. So, you know what? What's he want? Carrots, 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 carrots. You, are you an easier trade? Right. You want beetroot, no thanks. You there. Oh, you an easier to Please be potatoes. Right, I'm gonna go with the carrot guy. So with a villager, you, if you collect the thing they want, then you go up to them and you can trade with them. So I'm gonna go up to Mr. Farmer over here. I have the carrots you want. And then I can get an emerald. And then I can trade the emerald for Oon bread. And now I have six bread. And now I have food. And I'm going to make some baby piggies. So you there. And you there. Have baby piggies. So these pigs are going to have, look, a little baby pig. So I now have efficient food farming. Which is very good to start the sally on. Okay, what, what do you... You, are you the beetroot guy? Do you the beetroot guy? Okay, you're the rubbish beetroot guy. Um, so in this village, uh, this is where we're gonna start our base. So I know I've said I'm gonna take this blacksmith's house, so that's mine for now, but I'm gonna make some tools. And so I can make stuff better. You usually start with wooden tools, but I have this iron I collected from that chest, so I can cheat. And I need a crafting table. Okay, so you need sticks and pick. 
hand of you. Because I know that there are evil things down that abandoned mine shaft, so I need a pick. And then I'm also going to make a wooden sword to fight off any enemies that come and kill me. Um, so this thing here is a grindstone. It lets you repair and disenchant weapons. I'm not really later on in the game, but at the moment, they're pretty pointless because we have no weapons to disenchant. Um, so I'm heading over to this mesa, which is like a really cool biome, and you find so much gold in it. So in this mesa here, I'm going to just start hacking at the thing until it drops some good loot. There's uh, chests around as well. So that thing's evil, by the way. It, it spawns in bad guys. Oh, don't go through that one either. So um, there's all this cool loot. Um, there's diamonds and super golden apples and railway tracks and my later. They're quite cool. Okay, so I'm going to go down in this one because I know there's something cool in here, I think. So, ooh, that's a lower down bit. Oh, yes, some gold ore. That's another good thing about the mesa. Um, it's like gold is more common than iron in a mesa. So you can find loads of it. So um, this gold, it's going to be so useful if we ever get to the nether because piglins like it and they give you cool loot. Ugh, stupid piece of gold, let me collect you. Do I have any stone? Yes, I do. So I'm just escaping, and then I'm going to head this way. Um, It's very mad in here. There's loads of stuff. Um, So should I go left or right? I'm going to go right. Sorry, straight on. Uh... Is that iron I saw? No, come on. Okay, so these caves are really bad to navigate in because you can get very, very lost. But if you know like where you're going, they're really useful. So I'm looking. Oh, 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 what's in here? What's in here? Oh, coal. Some pumpkin seeds. Powered rails, powered rails. We'll need those for later. I'm planning on making a big minecart rack going everywhere. It'll be so cool. So I'm going to head out of this really claustrophobic cave for a sec. Um, this way. Because I have spotted something cool. There's a little bit of mine shaft across the river. I mean, how cool is that? Like, it goes across the river, but not. might go under, but yeah. That sucks. There's nothing there. So this mineshaft is completely randomly generated, which is really cool, except for the location. All the chests and loot are different, but the location is the same. Because I've played on this world before. So, uh, if you want to see um, me explore that more fully, that's next episode, because I'm too poorly equipped to do it this episode because i have like no good stuff so i'm gonna start building up my house now uh if i can find it where is that blacksmith that i've stolen there so the good thing about uh, having a blacksmith as your house is you have the free furnaces so i've got like 16 gold i'm gonna go inside first though and make up some torches how much string do I have? Only two. Oh, yes, I can make a fishing rod. So I can now go fishing. Uh, it's quite boring, so I'll, I'll do some, some off-camera, but basically... You fish, and you bobble it bobs, and pull it in, and you fish. Most of the time, anyway. Um, so, you like... Um, so, if you get this seed... Um, it's one, two, three, three, if you use it, by the way. Um, you can do all this stuff too because it's it's the same, and you can probably do more because I am not the best. So you'll probably find better stuff than me. 
but still. This is a little fishing hut. They're one of my favourite village buildings. There's nothing in there though. And then this is a cat. It's scared of you if you don't have any uh, fish, so. I would want fish so I can have a look at that. Oh my gosh, jackpot. Apples, bread, potatoes, and saplings. Perfecto. And then another. Nope, nothing in there for me to steal. And here. Bad hole. Nothing in here. Okay, so I'm going to go do some mining now. Oh, oh, what did I say? Perfect. So, um, iron. If you haven't heard of it, it's, it's, it's iron. Um, so you need it to make some good tools, and diamond's the best, of course, but I, I, you'll happily go for as a second. So, um, I'm collecting up lots and lots of iron if I can find it, so I can make armour and tools and other wonderful iron goodies. Okay, and, um, if you ever go caving, don't follow my advice. Always put your torches on the left-hand side, not like me just putting them randomly, because otherwise you get really lost. Okay, so. There's also an acacia over that way with an abandoned acacia village, because I've done this seed before. Um, experience points. And um, if it's dark and things, you don't know if your village will be safe. This guy, this big big massive evil thingy um he kills bad guys so actually villages are probably the safest place to be at night because he'll just beat up anyone who tries to attack so yeah oh another one these have loot in this type oh a book and more saplings so saplings are just like baby trees you can plant them and they grow into big trees so yeah oh got a spider so i want to make some more stuff by killing this thing ha, 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 ha. oh didn't drop it i need string to make things that use string like um a bow which is cool because you can shoot things with it or a fishing rod that you can fish with hello you're not supposed to be in here you're a fisherman not a House person. Ha. Ah. I stole his bed. I, I stole his bed. Okay, we have to go. Shut me. Great. Ah. Mm, bad, bad fisherman. Great. Let me trade. I said trade. Ah. Okay. Oh, he, he's... <laughs> if you pay him an emerald... And six fish, who cook your fish. He's absolutely rubbish. Right, hello cat. I'm going to cook up my, what you might call it, iron. So I can make iron tools. So I'll leave that to cook. And I'm going to go to the acacia biome. Because I, I love acacia biomes because they look really cool. So, um, it's just over this forest, if, if you have this seed as well. Um, it's like, it's like an African savanna, maybe an Asian savanna, I, I don't actually know, but still. Um, you, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. So, like, you can get different variants, like, like a mountain variant, sort of flattish variant. And um, eventually I'm going to get a horse, but you need a saddle, and they're really hard to find saddles. So, yeah. And this is a coral reef. I know, right? It's a coral reef. What's, what's cool? And you find sea pickles here. They're like an underwater light source. They're really cool as well. Pretty much everything's cool, you know? I'm lagging a bit, like how it's all choppy, that's lag. Complete and utter lag. So yeah. Oh god. 
gosh, it's really laggy. Oh, I can't even move. It's so laggy. Okay. So, lag is basically just torture. So, yeah. Don't mess with that. Now, where is this village? Okay. Um. So, this village, I don't think it exists. Bad luck to me, but... Maybe it'll just be over this hill. No, doesn't exist. I really thought I did. I definitely remember it. Maybe it's just this way. No, it doesn't exist. Sorry. Sorry about that. Anyway, um, that's all I have time for today. So, if you enjoyed this video... Don't forget to like and subscribe and good. Oh my gosh, actually not goodbye yet. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This, ow, is a portal ruin. It's another portal that's been ruined and chucked onto the earth. And it comes with a free gold block, and I want it. Okay, and there might be a loot chest somewhere. So I'm gonna see if I can, yes, there. And we might be able to go to the nether next episode. Hang on, no, we can't. Anyway, oh, and a gold chest. Anyway, we need a diamond pick, but we have a portal here. They have eight nether Good. Yeah.